There is a new place in Burlington to grab a quick bite to eat, sip on a micro-roasted coffee from a local roaster, or even grab a specialty juice. It is also a place where you can find breakfast sandwiches and breakfast burritos served all day. It's Pressed Cafe in the district, and the owners say that even though the food is fast, it doesn't mean it's unhealthy. Press Cafe is a quick service restaurant, which means that you would order your food at the counter and we bring your food to your table, where we offer fresh items fast. Um, I think a lot of people have a uh, misconception of, or a, a bad experience with fast food. The word fast food usually has a negative connotation, um, but our, our mission is to bring healthy and fresh options quickly, um, and including things like breakfast all day. Um, we have 16 breakfast burritos to choose from. Um, we have fresh salads, paninis, uh, and quinoa bowls, and mac and cheese bowls. We sort of have everything, something for everyone, I guess is another way you could look at it. This is the second pressed cafe location, the first being in Nashua, New Hampshire. Mary said that what appeals to customers there is that they work hard to get the food out in a timely manner, something that is helpful for busy people on the go. We actually found the same uh, sort of space available in Nashua, meaning that there wasn't a place where we could go and get fresh food fast. Something like if I wanted to get a, a really fresh salad, but I only had 10 minutes to go and grab it, I, there was nowhere really to go. Um, so providing that option for people that have um, a short lunch break or they don't have an hour and a half every day for lunch to go and get something to eat. Um, so having that fast element, but fresh, um, you know, when, when people want fast food, usually their options are fast, traditional fast food places. So um, we take a lot of pride in that every item on our menu um, is designed to have a three to five minute ticket time. Another feature of the restaurant is its selection of specialty juices, which will soon be an expanded item on the menu. Things we're really excited about um, to bring to Burlington is our juice bar. So we have a fresh juice bar with over I know, almost 15 fresh um, fruits and vegetables that you can choose from. You can build your own juices. We have six of our own recipes that we found have been really big hits. Um, so things like a juice cleanse is an excellent way to kick off like a, you know if, if you if you want to make a change in your in your diet or if you want to make that next step to be healthy juicing is a great option to do that. Um, a lot of people always want to try to juice from home and it ends up being really messy and extremely expensive and just to have that option to come here and and you know do a juice cleanse. Um, that's one of the things we're going to be launching um, early in the in the new year will be a juice cleanse program that people can come and do and help and provide some guidance for people who want to start doing it. Mary said that locating in Burlington was an easy decision. She and her family always loved coming here and when the opportunity to open up shop in town arose, they jumped on it. We love Burlington as a, as a town ourselves, um, as a city. We uh, are from Nashville, but we used to always come down to Burlington with our kids uh, to the Burlington Mall when the Rainforest Cafe was there and the Lego store and we always loved this um, area in general. Uh, we go to, you know, down by Flatbread and Bamboo. We're, we actually eat more in Burlington than we do in Nashua. So when we were presented with the opportunity, we just loved the, the city so much that we decided to um, just jump on the opportunity right away. The town, rather, sorry. Finally, she said the reception to town has been great. Amazing. I have to say the people in Burlington have been so receptive. They have been so um, welcoming to us. Uh, really excited to try us out. Um, and uh, our, our goal is to, uh, to fit the bill. I think, uh, I think we're, we're bringing Burlington what it was, has been looking for, but maybe didn't even know that they were looking for it yet. At Press Cafe, I'm B News Director Rich Hosford.